In this video, we're going to start looking at a way to solve a system of equations, two equations with two variables, without graphing. Graphing has some limitations. If the numbers aren't pretty numbers like 5 and 7, but instead they're 3.86, it's kind of hard to see that on a graph. It also has a limitation that large answers are hard to find as well. So other methods tend to be more preferred, and one of those methods is called substitution. The idea of substitution is we replace the variable with what it represents. Let's start with some very simple examples where we see that. Here we've got one equation that says x equals negative 3. Another equation, 2x minus 3y equals 12. Well, we already know that the variable x is equal to negative 3, and so when I look at the other equation and I see an x, I can replace that x with what it represents. 2x now becomes 2 times negative 3, minus 3y equals 12. This is something we can solve by first simplifying, giving us negative 6 minus 3y equals 12, and then solving the two-step equation. Adding 6 to both sides, negative 3y equals 18, and finally dividing both sides by negative 3, giving us y equals negative 6. We still want to express the solution as an ordered pair, similar to how we would express it on a graph, x comma y. It's always important the x comes first, it must be alphabetical, negative 3 comma negative 6 is the solution to this system of equations. Let's try another example where we can substitute or replace the variable with what it represents. Here we're told 4x minus 7y is 11, and we know that y is negative 1. Well, if y is equal to negative 1, we can replace the y with what it represents, the negative 1. So now that equation becomes 4x minus 7 times negative 1 equals 11. And again, all I have to do is simplify. 4x plus 7 equals 11, and solve the resulting equation. Subtracting 7 from both sides, 4x equals 4, and finally dividing both sides by 4, we get x is equal to 1. So our ordered pair solution, x comma y is 1 comma negative 1. By simply replacing the variable with what it represents, often we can quickly find ourselves the solution to the system of equations.